from the campus of Mount Mercy University, serving the Mount Mercy University community, and brought to you by the staff of the Mount Mercy Times, this is Mount Mercy Times TV. During a brainstorm for the 2015 Faculty Fall Series, one professor's idea was picked by Destiny. I am Megan Heron reporting for the Mount Mercy Times. Joseph Wynn, Associate Professor of Chemistry, discusses how the Vietnam War came close to not being mentioned as a possible theme. On my end, I, was, I wasn't even sure if I should bring it up because you know, the list that he had there were, or was a good list, but it was just one of those things I was, I was even sitting back there. You even, you know, I, I couldn't keep quiet. I was just like, I don't know how Joe's going to take this. You know, I, probably, you know, I even thought in the back of my head, I was like, I probably should have whispered this, you know, before Joe went up there because I knew. Because, I mean, he literally was just right across from me and I probably should have just tapped his shoulder and got to say, hey, you know what, I have another topic you might want to add on to your PowerPoint. But, you know, um, I couldn't, but there were some discussions going on elsewhere. And so I, I just kind of, I just kind of sat back and, you know, I mean, I literally did. I mean, I, you know, I'm not one of the most timid individuals at all. Um, <laughs> And I was, I was really, uh, I was really tentative to raise my hand and, and to suggest something else because we actually already had a lot of topics there. And uh, but when I when I brought that up, it was it was really interesting and, and really nice to hear the reception from from the faculty. With that. I was actually ple I, I was very surprised about how receptive people were, and and it it, it was really neat. I thought to hear the buzz. Like, especially when the vote finally finished, it was really neat to hear everybody talking. You know, it was one of those few times that, you know, that I think we've been at a faculty meeting that everybody was really on board and talking about it. And they were, you know, it just seemed like not everybody had something, but, you know, there were a lot of, there were a lot of faculty that were like, oh, yeah, we can come up with this and this and this. You know, and they would come up to me afterwards, and it was really interesting to hear. They're like, you know what, this is a great topic. You know, I would, you know... I got a lot more faculty coming up to me saying there are, they have a personal interest in trying to contribute to, to this faculty series, which, you know, uh, for me, it was very rewarding that uh, as busy as I am, it was one of those things that I was somewhat hesitant to bring it up because I know that if I did, I would have a personal interest and I would want to try to do certain things. The series will be held the fall 2015 semester, which is the 50th anniversary of American troops arriving in Vietnam and the 40th anniversary of the end of the war. Wynn has a personal tie to the war. His father had held a significant position and was destined to make a difference. Are there going to be guest speakers then at this event? I, I think so. I, I, you know, I, I think the beauty, you know, that was, that was the other thing as I was thinking about bringing this topic up, is that as relatable as it is, I think that, that you know, I think we have more people that could speak on it on a personal level. Uh, I personally, am, I'm gonna appeal to my dad and his friends to be like, hey, you know what? You know, we're doing this one thing. I would love, I, I think, you know, and one idea that I had in my mind is to truly have an event where we have both the American Vietnamese vets as well as the Vietnamese Vietnamese vet in one, you know, in one setting, maybe as, you know, um, get them together, just talk, and then just kind of have a, a, maybe a forum for, for people to just kind of interact. But I, I definitely think we'll have uh, guest speakers from that perspective. So one of the biggest things I think I would like to accomplish is I'd like to see uh, more individuals from, from the community coming on the campus. Because, I mean, that's a, that's a big part of the, the things that I've done is reaching out to the community a lot. And so, um, to me, I know I can't do it on my own. So, I, that, that's one of the things that I'd like to try to see is that the faculty and the community work together and make this a really successful series. And is this only the second fall series? Correct. So maybe next year there'll be more planning right. going into the faculty meeting. <laughs> oh yeah, I mean, I, I think so. I think you know, I think every year that we have some success and we learn from you know, and you know, we learn from other, you know our past mistakes. You know, we can always just kind of improve on that. The series is in the planning stage. Read the April 9th Mount Mercy Times issue for more information and details.